Welcome back to CAD CAM tutorial. Today we are going to design a simple bicycle air horn. We will design each and every part and assemble at the end of this video. I hope you like it. So let's see how to do in SOLIDWORKS. Now here let's make the first part of air horn beagle. So let's start. Choose here 3D sketch directly. Select front plane, normal. Select a line and draw a horizontal line. Then go back this part and it will automatically convert into a circle. Then draw a straight line. Exit. Now select these three points and make relation along y axis. Now let's define the dimension. One hundred five point forty two mm, twenty three point sixty six twenty one mm, and the length. sixty point eighty one forty one okay now make sure you selected front plane choose line again select this point go back to this point and it becomes a circle now do one thing just press tab once you press tab press the your mouse center key and drag this now see it's uh, draw a taper angle exit see we draw this circle in some particular angle now again choose front plane normal now we will define this see carefully how to define first select center line and draw one center line exit now make little edges again choose center line now connect this point and this point exit now define the angle twenty five point thirty eight mm select this radius twenty one point seventy sixty eight mm okay select normal select select line and select this point exit make sure okay select this two points line and make relation tangent okay select distance one hundred six point eleven forty one mm okay now this is the our three d geometry it is the shape and it is the path for air horn body simply exit from the sketch now we will create three planes here choose plane first select this line and select this center point this initial point okay again select this line plane now select this end point okay now here we created two planes okay now select this face sketch select circle and here draw a circle little adjust and let's define the diameter
23.20.67 now exit from the sketch now select this plane to sketch select circle and here draw a circle zoom now let's define this Eleven point sixty seven six mm. Okay. Now exit. Now we created two paths. Go to feature and select first lifted boss base. Here sketch two selected. Now select the sketch three. Drag this. Okay, it's looking nice. Select OK. Now this is the lifted command. With the help of lifted command, we make this. Now select this face sketch. Select convert entity. Now this circle is converted. Exit. Go to feature. Select swift boss base. This profile here selected. Just select the path. Now you can see we selected this path. Select here, OK. Now hide all the planes. See here the body is here selected. Just find out where is this is the front plane. So select front plane, a sketch, normal. Select li directly line and start from this point to draw a vertical line. Exit. Now define the dimension. Thirty four point forty three mm. Forty point eighty eight mm. Okay, this is the dimension. Now choose circle, small circle, or better to select center point arc. Select this end point as a circle. Select this point and draw a circle up to here. Exit. Select a line, connect up to here. Exit. Choose this spline. Select this point and connect with this point. Exit. Now this is a perfect shape. It is up to you, whatever shape you want. I will choose this radius. One point two five mm. Select here, OK. Now just try to revolve this body. Go to feature, select here, revolve boss base. Select this bottom line as axis, OK. Now you can see we created a nice body. Now we want to make this hollow. First, uh, make fillet. 1 mm and select this corner sharp edge ok that's it now choose fillet we want to make this should be hollow select this end and select last end show preview select here ok Okay, now see our bugle is hollow. You can see it here.
now here we will add some portions choose front plane sketch normal select here circle just find out this center point and draw one circle here okay and select this point and in between draw one circle and in this corner draw one circle now let's define one point eighty six mm two point one five mm and this bigger one three point six two mm okay choose center line and draw one center line exit now choose here revolve boss base see this line is selected and these circles are going to revolve 360 degree okay it's calculating now it's done see it's a rib created now let's i will give some warm kitchen go to uh, i'll prefer to give actually it should be polished bronze but it looks a very la dark i prefer gold gold color see this looks very nice you can see it here now let's save this part save part 1 go to desktop create one folder air horn select this air horn and make this first part bugle part number 1 now let's create the another part fittings clamps and rubber bulb now here let's make the next part rubber bulb choose front plane sketch select center line draw a horizontal line here select a line convert it into a arc then again convert it into a circle and select this line now select the center point of this circle and this line make relation coincide okay select this line construction geometry now let's define Eleven point sixty seventy six by two mm. Select this six mm. Twenty nine point seventy four mm the radius. okay now do one thing select this line and delete it go to sketch choose take little upward now choose spline and select this point exit
now select this point adjust according to your requirement choose smart dimension and select the overall length 83.62 mm okay choose offset entity select 0.62 mm and select this edge make sure it is outside okay choose a line and connect it one end close the another end okay again choose a line and close this end also exit now here let's try to revolve revolve boss base select this bottom line as a axis okay now save this as a part number 2 rubber bulb so this is the our second part let's do the next part rubber clamp let's make the third part clamp choose front plane and draw two circles from origin point now let's define 13.81 mm twelve point eighty one mm draw one center line choose line connect with this line and connect with this line now let's define keep the length 5 point Point seven five mm this width fourteen point eighty one mm. Now let's try five point five mm. Okay. Choose trim entity and trim this inside faces. Just make undo. Choose mirror entity and select these three lines. just mirror about this line okay choose the gap 0.2 mm okay trim entity and trim this inside lines okay now this is perfect okay now this is the separate body select extruded boss
extrude up to 5 mm okay choose fillet 0.5 mm and select this edge select this face sketch normal let's draw a center line select circle and draw a circle here make the diameter 3 mm okay and select extruded cut and make a throughout hole okay fillet select 1 mm select all the corners now let's define this material go to brass okay let's make uh, polished brass this is the third part so save it part number 3 clamp now let's start the assembly of air horn now here let's start the assembly of air air horn choose new assembly okay this is the solid works assembly window so we will first browse the parts uh, we prefer bugle first part and rubber bulb second part okay this is the bugle and rubber bulb i prefer background warm kitchen let's rotate the bulb choose mat select the inside face of bulb and upper side of rod okay now choose this outer edge and this edge clear this inside edge and outer edge make coincide okay now here the rubber fix with this bugle okay now let's bring the last part clamp select the inside face mat the upper upper face coincident relation okay now select this face and this face make gap 0.5 mm okay now see this is the our bugle now here we will fix the screw so just go to design library select toolbox go to nc matrix bolt and screw and uh, select machine screw i'll prefer here to fix a screw now do one thing just drag this pan cross head screw and select this hole now see it's showing select m3 select 2.5 mm length make 3 mm thread length also keep 3 mm 
स्केमेटिक सेलेक्ट ओके सेलेक्ट कैंसल नाउ सेलेक्ट दिस फेस मैट दिस फेस कोसेंट्रिक रिलेशन ओके नाउ इट इज फिक्स सी दिस इज मशीन स्क्रू सो यू कैन स्क्रू इट बाय स्क्रू ड्राइवर ओके सो दिस इज यवर सिंपल प्रोजेक्ट एयर हॉर्न आई होप यू लाइक इट प्लीज सब्सक्राइब अवर चैनल फॉर मोर वीडियो एंड मोर प्रोजेक्ट इन सॉलिड वर्क एंड डोंट फर्गेट टू शेयर एंड लाइक अवर वीडियो आई होप यू एंजॉय थैंक्स फॉर वॉचिंग